Creepers, it's me, Carly, and this week on Curl with Carly, I am going to be doing a leotard haul collection thing. You ask, you shall receive. As they say. So, once again, we've got the rack out there in rainbow order from red to black. And I'm just going to go through. I've got some new suits from last time, some the same. Also, I'm missing one suit. It looks like this. Annie has it. And Annie, if you're watching this, please uh, give it back to me. So, let's hop right on into it. That was a squat. Oh, okay. Starting off with my first suit. Oh my god, my voice cracks. This was my first trampoline comp suit, and it's become a training suit now. And it looks like this. It's got our, like, jumper guy. This is the jumping man. Logo on the side, and it's red, and it still fits me five years later. I don't know what the brand is, but I know that it's from Quebec. The next suit I have is this red one. It's got flowers on it, and I've had this. I got this for my 12th birthday from one of the girls I did gym with. I don't know what brand it is because it doesn't have, like, any logo on it at all. I like it, and it still fits. It hasn't fallen apart yet. I wonder if it has a tag. It does. It's from Illusion. Okay, my next suit is my first Team Ontario training suit. This this one is the 2017 one, I believe. Maybe 2016. 16 or 17 suit. I really like this one. It's really comfortable. And it's got the silver um, trillium in the top. It's pretty cute. It's by Jaguar and I like it. And it's the latex material, so it's like really stretchy. Going alongside that suit, we have the matching comp suit that I got when I competed at Easterns. I'm really happy I got to go to Easterns and that I got to wear this before they changed the suit. But it's got the silver sleeve. And it's got trilliums all over it. And I love that there's so much detailing on the silver side. My last red suit is so beautiful. Yeah, this is what it looks like. It's the Team Ontario suit. You would have seen this if you watched my like unboxing of all my Team Ontario gear. This is what it looks like. It's so pretty. Oh my god. It's got so many sparkles on it. It looks amazing when we're in stadiums. And I love the detailing on the arm. Ombres to black, it's absolutely gorgeous and it's by Jaguar. So much creds to Serena because this is the most amazing suit ever. My next suit I've had quite a while and it appears in a lot of my videos, but it's my Batman suit and I love it. Still fits me. All the diamonds that I got are still on it and the suit is by Jaguar. This is my newest suit. You would have seen it if you watched my shopping for leotards, which is one of my big videos right now. It's got army print on it. I've always wanted an army print suit. It looks really nice on me. I'm really happy with it. And it's a different material. It's their new one that's like really soft. So like it's nice if you're in training you rub your belly and it feels good. Like just so you know, they don't stretch as much. They do stretch like a bit. I got a size up from what I normally wear because of that and it just fits more comfortably that way. Feel free to even go two sizes up from what you normally wear because they really, like I stress, they don't stretch. Yep, this is by Jaguar. My next suit is a plum suit. It's a really nice suit. I don't love this uh, sparkly mess right here. This suit says IGC on it because I went to international gymnastics camp. I had a really awful time and I'm kind of sad that I have this suit because I don't want to advertise the camp. Yeah, I went there. It was really bad, but this is what my suit looks like. It's navy blue on the front and it's got all the sparkles and then the back's got this cool design on it. And it's, it's like pretty comfortable and it's by Plum and I think this size is the same as my other ones, but this one fits bigger. And I really hope that they like upgraded their sizing charts because there isn't a huge variety in sizes. I'm glad that this one is made bigger so that there's more size variety. My next suit is my competitive gymnastics suit. This is my first gymnastics long sleeve suit. And my last ever gymnastics comp suit. It's seafoam green, which is an interesting choice in color. And then the sleeves are white. If you are ever going to be designing a suit out there or buying a suit, keep in mind a lot of the girls on the team had issues of the underneath the armpits. There was like a yellow circle from sweat. So always keep that in mind with a white suit. Honestly, it looks really good on me and I feel very fortunate that I didn't end up with a yellow circle. I don't know if it's because we washed it differently or better, um, but I didn't end up with one so I think it looks really good. But just keep that in mind when getting a suit not I don't recommend white in general this is my next suit it's from Jaguar also plaid I got it at Ontario Championships one of the years I think it was my level 2 season as like a little thing because I won my next suit I believe it's called blue lava but I don't remember and I'm not sure if they still make this design I really like how it looks it's got an open back which is really great it literally never gives you a wedgie because it has an open back it's not like pulling the back up it's only pulling the top when you bend over so this doesn't move 
So you never get a wedgie. And if I ever order suits online and like get to custom design them, I always will go for that from now on because I love that. Overall, I really like this suit. I actually ripped it. I was in the bathroom at the gym and when I was pulling it up, it like was wrapped, it was like rolled within my shorts and I ripped like this part here, but we re-sewed -sew it. And I still love it and wear it. This next suit is from Plum Practice Wear. They sent it to me like two years ago or something like that. And it's just got butterflies on it and it's blue. My next suit is from Jaguar. This is one of my gymnastics training suits from quite a while ago. Starting to grow out of it, which I guess is a good thing. I got it when I was 12. It has a G on it for the gym name and this is just what it looks like. My next suit, also from Jaguar, I know, shocker. This one has a butterfly on it and it's done with the gems. And this was, I think, one of the last suits they released before going to flat gems. And I really like it. It has mostly all of its gems on it still, and I've had it for, I think, oh, about two years now. Tragic story, there's like bleach here from when we were doing laundry. And um, yeah, so I have to wear it with shorts now. This was my old competition suit. Uh, this is by Jaguar, and this was one of my gymnastics comp suits. It's a mixture of like a lot of different materials. It's mostly made out of the latex material, and it's got gems on it. And there's like a mesh, but it's on top of the latex. So it's like very thick and layered because there's a lot of different things going on. It's a really nice suit though, uh, but I'm kind of grown out of it. So it's more just one that I have more than I wear. I like it a lot and I wish it was bigger. My next suit is from Saucy's World. And I really like this one. This was a hand-me-down from one of the girls at my gym. It's super cool how it like ombres into all these designs. If I was the one making the suit, I would actually flip it so that it's black on the bottom just because I usually wear shorts and I wish this wasn't covered by my short. But sometimes I don't wear shorts and I really love how this looks and I love the bottom of the suit. I think it's so pretty. This suit is my favorite suit and it's reoccurred in videos many times. It's my super Carly suit. I love it a lot. It's from Saucy's World and I really just love that it's personalized with the C on it and it was made really well. It's lasted me quite a few years. I think I got this in like my first year provincial. It's been like four years now and it still fits and it's still lasting me and I really hope I never grow out of it or rip it or anything because I don't know if I'll be able to find another one. This next suit is from Jaguar. This one has like all the crazy stuff going on at the top and it ombres to black at the bottom and I really love the blue. I think I got this at one of the comps this year and it's just a pretty snazzy suit. My next suits are two of the same. I have all of Aliza's old suits because she doesn't do tramp anymore. And so, yeah, I have my suit and her suit, and these are just the old training suits. These are last season's training suits. They have the flat, be the flat bead logo on them in silver. Both the suits are from Jaguar, and I love that they're really silky and soft. Sadly, these show sweat, like, a lot. In the summer times, we refrain from wearing them, but during the year, they're great suits to wear. This suit, I believe, I got this year or last year. I'm not 100% sure but it's made with the soft material, so as I said, it's nice when you rub your belly during training, and it's actually become a joke where we say, for good luck, you rub my belly when I'm wearing the suit, and it's actually been working, so that's kind of cool, and it's made with, like, a kind of cheetah thing, and it has different, it has, like, white stripes to be, like, hair, and it's really cool. I really like it, and I think one of the girls in my gym had this when I went to gymnastics, like, my very first year when I was nine, so it's kind of nostalgic for me because I remember always seeing this at the gym. This is my next suit. I use this one to compete in as well as it's our training suit. I usually do synchro with this one because it's the only suit that's short sleeve that everyone has. I really love this suit. I'm really happy with it. It's from the company in Quebec that our gym uses. It was made really well. Normally we have the like man on our suit but this is the first year we did it without it and I really prefer this one and because it looks a lot classier. It's kind of like something similar to the to the design that was on the long sleeve gym suit and it's navy blue and then white at the top and it's really nice. This is from Plum Practice Wear. It's my USA suit and it's one of the flip side ones that has a different back. This is one of my favorite plum ones other than the one Annie stole. Please give it back to me. And it looks like this. It has the bedazzled USA on the front. And then I really like the white with all the slashes in the back. This suit is from Jaguar and it's called Purple Lava. I don't know if they still make the design, but I don't believe they do. It's just a basic suit. Like there's no crazy back to it, but I got it along with my blue lava suit. I got them like at the same time. I just think this is a nice suit. I like it. I wear it. It's purple. I really love how this suit looks on me and I think it's like very complimentary to my skin tone. 
This is like a con candy sort of vibe. It's got pink, blue, and purple on it with purple rims. It's from Jaguar. And I just really like how it looks on me. And I don't know if I was expecting it to like go with my skin tone this well, but it does. And the back's got like swoosh, like it's all very like consistently done. Yeah. This suit is from Jaguar. It's kind of similar to the flip side thing where it's got stuff on the back and then the back stuff on the front and then the back is plain black and it looks really cool when I'm doing my twisters and stuff at Tram and all it is is it goes like blue to purple to blue again and it's like a pinky purple in the middle when I am wearing it because nylon is like made to be stretchy this turns into like a really light blue and then a light pink uh, but it still looks really good and it's not see-through which is awesome this is my next suit this was a hand-me-down from Eliza I actually got this for her for her like 13th birthday and then when she quit I got it back uh, this one has the kind of off the shoulder type sleeve which isn't my favorite design but you know free suit not gonna complain it's got just the black one sleeve and then the design is like normal throughout and it's kind of it gives me like paintbrushy vibes it's got like dots lots of different colors on it it doesn't look su super busy when you're wearing it like it does here it's from jaguar of course this suit is from plum practice wear it also gives me a very paint stripey feeling it's got blue purple pink and white on it it's not see-through, which is really exciting. Throwback to this suit. <laughs> Wait till you see the... <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> this is my first ever competition suit from when I did gymnastics when I was nine years old. And I still wear it sometimes, but it's still long enough for me to wear. So that's pretty awesome, I guess, or weird, depending what you want it. <laughs> How you want to interpret that. I feel like I've taken really good care of it. Oh, what brand is this? We don't know the brand. The tag is like super old. It's white. This suit was a hand-me-down suit from one of the girls at my gym. It also has the open back, which I love. It's a really, really long suit, so I don't always wear it because it doesn't fit me that well. Like, it, it's like very bunchy at the back, but that's just because she was really tall. This is so Spongebob-y, and I think it's kind of funny. We're almost done. This suit is from Plum Practice Wear. It's their rainbow one. I really don't wear this one that often. I'm going to be fully honest with you guys because I feel like I should be. They put red right on the nipple, and it looks weird to wear, and I feel uncomfortable. I don't want to... I. I'm sorry if they wanted to work with me again. They kind of dropped me. This this suit's like a lot more childish than what I want to wear. Uh, a lot of my suits from over the years have gone from rainbow to more solid colors. And I'm really staying in like the blue and black area right now, as you can see. Uh, so this suit has a lot going on. And also, as I said, there there's red. It's like red and it's shaped like a nipple on the nipple. I can't wear it. Like... <laughs> Sorry. This suit is another duplicate. This suit is from two years ago, I believe, our training suit at the gym. It's got the sparkles on it, and it has our red bouncer man, and he's made out of sparkles. This one, this suit was such a flop. All the sparkles fell off. Um, I really didn't wear my suit at all that year because I was scared that the sparkles were going to fall off, and I was like, what if I need to compete in it, and it looks weird. So I didn't wear this suit much. This one's from Quebec. But now that the season, like now that I don't use it other than for training, uh, I wear it a lot more. It's really comfortable, obviously doesn't show sweat. We like that it's black, but like the sparkles fell off. It's kind of, most people just have a plain black suit now. Okay, Lauren, she is Laura Flips underscore on Instagram, just texted me and was like, what is your favorite leotard? And I'm like, I'm literally in the middle of filming a video right now. That's so funny. What suit was I on? We were on the black ones. Next suit is my Team Ontario training suit. This is the 2018 one that I unboxed last year. And this one will continue to be ours for, I think it's like four years. They rotate them or two years, I forget. This is what it looks like. I really like it. It's very simple and plain. It's really nice to wear to training days when you go to competitions, training camps, or just for normal training. I would totally compete in this. It's a really great suit. It's by Jaguar and I love how it looks and the sparkles stay on the diamonds are still on my next suit was um well it happened in a moment of like I don't know what I was thinking in the moment <laughs> my competition suit for my trampoline club is a long sleeve black leotard and I don't know what I was doing that night but I was like I hate the sleeves and I cut them off So I 
cut the sleeves off this suit and honestly I hated the suit I hated how it looked, I hated the sleeves, I was uncomfortable in it, it was way too small. When I got it, it was too small, and now it's been four years, and every year they're like, we're gonna change it, so I haven't bought a new suit. So I still have the same suit, because I'm like, they're gonna keep it for just this year, there's no point getting a new suit for just this year. But then, here we are, four years later, they haven't changed the suit, and I cut the sleeves off. So this is what my suit looks like. I love it now that there's no sleeves. It doesn't ride up my butt. It's so much freer. It's not super hot. I don't overheat in it anymore. I like it. My mom is a real G and she sewed it for me the night before a competition, like hand sewed it. So there's a lot of loose strings on it and it's a little jagged, but so am I. Now that it looks like a muscle tank, I feel like I can show my arms off and I can breathe. So it makes me really happy to wear this suit and also everyone's like why is your suit different from your gym and I'm like I'm special they gave me my own type of suit. A lot of you might be thinking like my coach would kill me. I was thinking the same thing and I walked into the gym and I was like hey and she was like I love how it looks we should offer that as one of the options for the suits and I'm happy that no one tried to kill me at the gym. My next suit is matching and it's the same exact one with long sleeves. I did make sure I had another one. This one's a hand-me-down from Cassie or Maddie. I don't know whose it is. Maddie doesn't do tramp anymore and Cassie's at a different gym. But yeah, so this is the long sleeve version. I made sure that I had a long sleeve one before I cut the sleeves off in case they tried to kill me, in case my coach tried to kill me. But here we are, we're alive and this is, this is my long sleeve suit and I love it. Wait, sorry, I said I love it. I don't. Long sleeve suits suck now that I've lived the life of short and long. Short sleeve suits. Oh my god, guys. The most beautiful suit you're ever going to see is about to be seen. And it looks like this. I freaking love this suit. I was at Jaguar and I saw this and I fell in love. I wore it at my Elite Canada competition and I became Canadian champion. And this suit... I, it's the only time I've worn it, and now it has like such great memories attached to it. I love it. It looks so beautiful. So basically, it's black. It ombres to white, and then it goes back to black on the bottom to make sure that like it's got these like blue things all over it. Not quite sure what they are. They're like triangle-ish things. And then the chest ombres too, and there's diamonds on it. And this was way too much money, but I love it, and it was worth it, and I would buy it again. And I'm so excited to be competing at National. Well, okay, I'm not excited to be competing at Nationals because I've been competing since November, so I'm kind of done with the season at this point. But I'm competing at Nationals, and I really, really am hoping and I'm excited to wear this out on the floor. This is my final suit. I don't know if I said that. This is my final suit. My last two suits are another dupes. These are, once again, one's mine, one's Aliza's. I don't know which is whose. This is what they look like. They've got the bouncer man on the side, and they're white. This was from my first year provincial, which was my second tramp season. They, they just look like that. There's nothing really to it. Okay, guys, overall, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You guys kept asking for it, so I figured I should deliver. If you want to see more leotard stuff, let me, don't know, let me know down below. Message Jaguar. Tell them to work with me because I would love to. And obviously, I'm a huge supporter of their brand considering almost every suit of mine is from there. Really excited to hit a 1,000. It feels like a huge landmark that we've been working towards for so long. Like and share with your friends. And if you guys want me to have more, then we need to hit a 1,000 subscribers so I can afford it. Be sure to like, comment, and hit that subscribe button. I'm going to flip out. Bye! I have to put all of these hangers away and all of the clothing that I was on the floor that, that from the hangers, I have to put away too. That is the end of the video. I make lots of videos. This is a dumb song, so enjoy. Also hit the subscribe button.